G'day there, Mark here. You know, today I thought we'd have a bit of fun with the pressure chamber and take a banana down to 90 meters. See if it implodes, squashes. I mean, in theory, it's fibrous, full of water. It shouldn't, but will it? Don't know, the bananas are soft. Will it be all bruised and black? So they, um, yeah, we'll put it in the chamber. I've set it up already. There it is. So let's open it up and start the experiment. Here we go. Oh, straight down. That's the pressure just pushing it down. Okay, we're coming up to 20 meters. No change. Come up to 30 meters. Doesn't cause any change. 30 meters. No change. Nice pressure pot, this one. Well built, strong, safe. Built in the US. Okay, we're coming up. 40 meters. Let's go to 50. Let's have a look. Stop it at 50. All right, stopped at 50. Doesn't look like there's any change. No change. Let's go again. Let's go all the way up to 70 now. 60 meters. 65 meters. 70 meters and we'll stop it again. 70 meters. No change. 70 meters, no change. Let's go again. 80 meters. Ah, oh, that's a lot of pressure. What's it? At 90 meters, what have we got? 10 atmospheres? 90 meters, 10 atmospheres. That is a lot of pressure and banana hasn't changed. Three hundred and ten feet hasn't changed. Well, looks like the banana won that one. But let's get it out and just find out, see what it looks like. So I'll empty the pot. Might be a bit of noise now, just bear with it. Coming back. It should float. When it gets empty, I suppose it should float again. It should come up. Okay, we're back to 40 metres. Thirty meters. Twenty meters. Hey, we're right, ten meters. Five meters. There we go. Oh, look at that. Empty. There you go. I reckon the banana has won that one. Okay, now I've taken the lid off. And there it is. Looks pretty good. Oh, it's gone a bit mushy. Hmm, there it is. But you know, it's you can still eat it, I suppose. Been down to, it's been down to 90, nearly 100 meters, 10 atmospheres, so survived. But anyway, there's our little little bit of fun and science, citizen science for today. All right, thanks for watching.